Another interesting aspect of food chain is how unknowingly some harmful chemicals enter our bodies through the food chain. When we pollute our environment, some living organisms, generally called pests, are developed here. We need to control or destroy these pests, so we use certain chemicals called pesticides. Pesticides can include herbicides, insecticides and fungicides. There are even pesticides in some household cleaning products such as toilet bowl cleaner, disinfectant and mildew remover. Such pesticides or heavy metals move up the food chain. As these chemicals are not degradable, these get accumulated progressively at each tropic level. These chemicals work their way into rivers or lakes and are eaten by aquatic organisms such as fish which in turn are eaten by large birds, animals or humans. As human beings occupy the top level in any food chain, the maximum concentration of these chemicals gets accumulated in our bodies. This phenomenon is known as biological magnification. This is the reason why our food grains such as wheat and rice, vegetables and fruits and even meat contain varying amounts of pesticide residues. They cannot always be removed by washing or other means. There is an increasing concern about what effect pesticides have on human health and the environment. On human health and the environment, pesticides can end up in our water and some pesticides degrade to form byproducts. Pesticides can potentially pollute the soil, water and air. This pollution can be hazardous to people, pets and wildlife, especially when stored, handled, applied or disposed of improperly. Multiple health problems have been identified with prolonged consumption of pesticides. Some include weight gain, allergies, stomach infection and major ailments like kidney disease, respiratory problems, skin diseases and even cancer.